Good morning. Uh, I'm up and ready to go to my pre-op appointment. It is at 8.15. Right now it is right at 7, so we're about to leave to take the kids to school. And then right after that, Jonathan, you know, I can't drive right now, so he is going to take me to my post-op appointment. I'm very excited. I had a good night's sleep, slept about five solid hours, then was awake for a little bit, went back to sleep, slept another two or three. Um, it's been good. So I've gotten up and walked. I've been using this really weird thing. Um, I had to use it once before when I had double pneumonia, but I'm using it now and you have to um, like suck in and hold it and see if you can raise this thing and it helps keep you from getting pneumonia or other um, things settled into your lungs, uh, the fluids. So that's been good. I'm going to show you my, um, my scars. So let's see how this looks. No day. Okay. So that, that's where my scars are. I've got one over here, one here, and one here, and then one way up here. So this one's kind of ugly. Um, and they all are actually, they all have kind of like a little skin dot. I'm not really sure. That's just where they closed it up or what, but that's what it looks like right now. Um, I do still have the little, obviously the, the fat, the extra fat down here, but I've got four incisions. They're not too bad. Um, here's where one of my, from my hysterectomy, um, healed. So it's the same kind of scar, but it's already healed up down here. So, um, so obviously I don't, I don't think it's going to be too bad. It'll just, it'll just take a little while for it to, to heal. Um, but yeah, overall, not feeling bad. Everything's, everything's pretty decent. Um, I drank not, not all of a bottle of water yesterday. I drank some of it. And then this morning I've started just working very slowly on the Gatorade Zero. Blue is my favorite, but red's fine too. And uh, I did put on some makeup. I wanted to feel more like me. And then when I get home, I'm probably going to try to lay down and take another nap for a little while. So we will see. Um, if anything changes at post-op, I will post a video and let you know what they've said. Right now, I'm just supposed to rest, get up and walk every couple of hours, use my little weird air thing every couple of hours. I do, uh, let's drop a stick. I do 10 of those uh, every few hours. So if anything changes after the doctor, then I'll let you know.